built in Rossi. Justin's working on one of his 4-H projects. He's doing a poster about the history of Bobcat, which he just learned this year that Bobcat started off in Minnesota. Right? Yep. Mm -hmm. Jessica's also working on a 4-H project. She's working on cookies. I made chocolate chip cookies and then my grandma's no-bake cookies. <laughs> We're just getting started with our 4-H heifers, getting them clipped up. And we usually, with the kids, we like to start with the smallest ones and then work our way up. So this is Jessica and Bambi. Hey, Bambi. Okay, so we're at the fair. We're just getting ready to start getting the decorations up. So here's our before. And there we go. Here's our almost finished project. Do a little switching around once we get all the cows here. All right, we got Katie and our Guernsey Market Steer Baron loaded up. And I'm gonna bring him up to the fair and meet Alan there. It is Thursday morning at the fair, so we are just getting all of the cattle caught so when Alan's dad comes, we can get them loaded up and head out. Alan and Paul are just finishing up chores. Oh, Justin, <laughs> you kind of cut in front there. Female, probably the best balance today. Uh, really long 
outside it. Really big foot at a uh, female that gets college travel with a lot of confidence. If we change her at all, uh, she does carry maybe a, a little bit more condition than the heifer in second. Uh, but I think she's an heifer that in terms of her structure, her type, and her time, really a nice smooth cow prospect here to, to lead off the class. If you like the Red Angus heifer in second, I sure don't blame you. I think she's actually a little fresher in her appearance than uh, the heifer that wins the class. Uh, she's a little sharper, more angular through her front end, a little cleaner and neater through her, her neck and her shoulder. Uh, maybe a female that isn't quite as big a footed, uh, one that doesn't have quite as much natural muscle shape as that for that wins the class, but one that's still sound, uh, and going to be a nice common cow for this young, young exhibitor. Uh, young man, Galvey Heifer coming in next, the red heifer, uh, if you want to pull her ahead. I think a female that you certainly have to appreciate her, she's a long body individual, uh, one that gets out, has some, some frame and some dimension to her. Uh, maybe if we'd like to change her a little bit to get a little bit higher in class, we'd like to smooth it out through her shoulder a little bit. A level her on the hooks up again just a little bit, but uh, you know, you have to appreciate uh, for her broken attention. A young uh, lady. He wants to show beef. Uh, uh, 
Justin, it's fine. There we go. Come on. There we go. <laughs>
153. And then we're going to move into the turbocharged 16,000 pound plus Keith Johnson, Nick Peterson, and Tacoma Davidson. And that's the end of the show.
Or I'm not sure what he's driving. Okay. 4020 wasn't turbocharged. On the track.
He's gonna go over forward. Eight or one one nine. One one nine is our buyer at eight hundred dollars. 